Hello everyone, welcome to Zero Island Official. Today I'm gonna show you how to make invisible wall. So there's two ways how to make the invisible wall. First, you can type in here blocking volume and click and drag your blocking volume in here uh, in your location that you want to block the path. Okay, just scale up. Make sure this blocking volume is blocking your path okay and then play so you can see my character cannot go forward it's blocked by invisible wall okay that's the first one so the second one you can use a blueprint just delay this right click blueprint class select the blueprint actor and name it bp underscores invisible wall okay. open up add component type static mesh okay choose cube or whatever your static mesh is okay compile now you can put the wall in here your in your path that you want to block of course and you need to scale up there's two way how you can scale scale up just scale in the root or you can scale up in the static mesh i will scale up in my static mesh Here, just like this so if i hit play as you can see the wall is visible so i just need to turn off the wall to make the wall is uh, invisible okay how to do that i will show you just click in the even graph right click type even begin play okay and here type uh, height set actor hidden in game okay so just check this compile and play so you can see the world is invisible now okay so what's the difference between uh, blocking volume and the blueprint actor for invisible wall so the difference is if you just want to blocking a path without uh, making a blueprint or making the event you can use a blocking volume this is a very simple but if you want to uh, let's say you want to make a event i will show you uh, first if you want to go to here if you want to go to specific specific place and the path is blocking and you need to let's say trigger something by open or get the key and then after get the key you go to the previous location that the path is blocking and the path will uh gone or unblock so you can go through the path okay so how to do that i will show you let's say this is a this is path that has been blocked so you need to make a two uh, collision type a box collision I will name it this a uh, box collision uh, box collision key let's say this one. okay and the other one is just type box collision and name it box collision trigger just drop to here so there's a two box collision here and you need to make a variable let's say this is a open app you can name it whatever you want to name okay this is for example only okay first 
you need to click in here box collision trigger and uh, right click even a uh, collision and add component begin overlap okay in the other actor just click and drag here and type uh, cast to third person character okay third person character this is in my case in your case you can cast to your uh your character whatever your character name is okay after, after cast to this third person you need to add branch okay make a branch this just click and drag the open path and connect it to the condition if true okay if true let's say uh there is two way how to uh how to destroy this collision first you can type uh, destroy actor so after the you get the boolean open path is true you can destroy this blueprint or you can make it the collision is uh disabled okay just click your static mesh and drag in here and type uh, collision enable okay set collision enable and make this no collision okay choose no collision and make it true if true the collision will no collision okay will become no collision and then you need to make the another one box collision key just right click add even box collision key collision add component begin overlap in our director just type cast to third person character or whatever your blueprint blueprint character name is okay so if the character hit this collision you need to set open path to true okay compile save okay now in here you have two collision okay you have two collision first the collision for trigger and the second one is the collision key so i will click this collision key and i will put in here i will put in here i will scale up like this and this i will click this box collision trigger i make it bigger like this so i just play okay if i don't have a key this wall is uh, invisible and have a collision okay i need the key so if i go to this location in this case i will i put the key in here so i got the key i go here and if i trigger this collision so the invisible wall become a collision see Or you can make this destroy, okay? Destroy actor. The same. It depends how you want to make. This again. Invisible and have a collision. If I go here, I get the key. And oh, sorry, I don't trigger the key. The invisible wall now is destroyed so yeah guys that's the end of tutorial how to make the invisible wall thank you very much for watching this video please consider give like subscribe or comment below see ya then